Why is the number of plastic parts in vehicles growing? We're going to find out next. They say that 2021 will be the year of the electric vehicle, which means more plastic parts to reduce weight and cost, especially important on electric cars because the lighter the weight, the greater the range. This means you're going to have several, if not dozens, of damaged plastic parts on each vehicle you repair. Should you repair the damaged part or replace it? Three questions to ask are, number one, is the repair of the part prohibited by the OEM? If so, then replace the part. Number two, is the damaged area over a radar sensor? If so, replace the part. Number three, is the part structural, like a bumper beam? Can the part affect airbag deployment, like interior trim over an airbag? If either answer is yes, then replace the part. If the answer to each of these questions is no, then there are several points to consider before repairing the part. Number one, cost. If the replacement part is cheap, just replace it. You have bigger battles to fight. Number two, time. Cars sitting there waiting for parts are no good for anybody. You can accelerate your cycle time by repairing parts that are on back order. Number three, skills. The part might be repairable, but are your technicians up to the task? Number four, tools and equipment. If your technicians have the skills to repair plastics, but don't have the necessary equipment to do the job, you're handicapping yourself. Number five, environment. Since there's no nationwide company picking up scrap plastic bumpers anymore and no financial incentive to collect them, millions of them are clogging up landfills every year. You have the power to decide whether each damaged part is sent to the landfill or not. Over the last 50 years, there have been huge changes in every facet of the collision repair industry. One constant, however, is the presence of plastic parts in vehicles and their ever-expanding use into different areas of the vehicle. In the age of ADAS, battery electric and autonomous vehicles, the use of plastic parts will only continue to expand. I'm Jason Stahl. Thanks for watching.